morning everyone and welcome to the first spotlight on learning assembly for this new academic year today's spotlight will be hosted by myself erham and also may last week we reminded everyone to be responsible geckos with their learning are you making sure that you are on time and trying your best during lessons have a think about this week what learning are you really proud of let's also remember our personal goal to be kind it is so important to be kind to ourselves. Make sure you get 9 to 11 hours sleep at night. Have a good bedtime routine. Switch off your devices and read a good book. This will help you to sleep well and feel much fresher and ready for learning the next day. Sleep also helps us to be resilient. Hala in Your 6 has created a short video on top tips for relaxing. Maybe you can get some ideas to try at home. Hi, here are five ways that help me relax. Number one, listen to music. Here are some songs that help me relax. Number two, drawing helps me a lot. Number three, talking with my friends online. Number four, playing with fidgets or slime. And last but not least is taking a match, a scented candle, lighting it on fire and just watch the fire and as well as smell the flavor which is sand and fog and it's very relaxing. But of course before I do this I have supervision and ask my parents so nothing bad happens. Five things that help me relax. Bye! Now, let's open up this assembly with a spotlight on learning. This week, Jed from Year 2 has shared a video of himself playing the drums. Jing Yi has also shared a video of herself playing the piano. This just goes to show that practicing a skill a lot really can help develop a fantastic talent. Take it away, Jed and Jing Yi. Thank you, Jed and Jing Yi. You have shown us that you are both rigorous learners. Well done! In more news of Nexus Learner's success, we would like to congratulate Offer in Year 4 and Alia in Year 6 for being the finalists for the Ames Writing Competition and receiving their certificates. Well done to both of you and thank you to all learners who took part. Now let's see what learning has been going on this week.
thunder growled overhead. Zelda crouched in the darkness, fearing. Wind lashed the glistening tarmac, and street lights flickered, casting long shadows across the darkened wall. Rusted dustbins rattled in the wind, fences creaked, and the rain drummed on car roofs. Zelda shivered. Where could she escape from the dying? Some ways I relax my brain. Play music. Go for a swim. Take a nap. Read a book. See ya. Before we go to Miss Claire, we would like to wish those who are celebrating their birthdays this week a happy birthday. Happy birthday to Willow and Marco in year six, and happy birthday to Andrea and Mahanam in year one. Happy Friday, everybody, and welcome to Mr. Rob's Reminders on this lovely Friday. Now, we have just had a week of online learning, and we've been learning to be respectful pangolins, and we've been communicating like our friend the silver leaf monkey. Here they are to explain just how we've been doing that. Over to you. Hi everybody, it's me, the respectful pangolin. And today I'm going to be giving you some tips on how to be respectful during our Google Meets. The first thing we must remember is that in a Google Meet, we should always have our cameras on if possible. That way the teacher can check if you're listening and if you understand and that you are concentrating. Uh, Mr. Rob, are you there? Could you put your camera on, please? Oh, I'm very sorry, respectful pangolin. I'll leave it on now. Sorry about that. Thank you, Mr. Rob. Now, has anyone got any other ideas of how we can be just like me and respectful during a Google Meet? I have a good idea. I have a good idea too. I'm really good at communicating. Listen to what I've got to say. I'm sorry, Silverleaf Monkey, but that's not very respectable. It was the turtle's turn. You must let her finish. I have a good idea. Remember to keep your microphone muted if it's not your turn. Yes, resilient turtle, you're quite right. We must take turns and only turn our microphone on if we've been asked to. Well done. Thanks, everyone. Great ideas. You can be respectful like me by leaving your camera on and be a good communicator like the silver leaf monkey by keeping your microphone on mute unless it's your turn. Have a go, Nexus, and see how you get on. Bye. Thank you very much to Irhan and May for a fantastic job presenting. Well done to Jed and Jingyi for sharing their talents with us. Keep those coming, everybody. And well done to all of you who have managed to join every lesson on time. You've been responsible geckos, you've worked hard and you've submitted your work. Just please remember, everybody, we want you to treat learning from home just like learning at school so really try your best to be online on time for the lessons make sure you go to every lesson 
If you are having any difficulties at all, just ask your parents to let the class teach know. We will support you and we will be understanding. But if we don't hear from your parents, we do expect that you attend every single lesson. Okay, let's keep learning and doing our best, everybody. Okay, have a wonderful weekend and we will see you online next week.